everyone. So my name is Oluwan Kremi Bulwati Fe Abiola and you are welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> okay, so yes, I'm really excited to say that because this is my first video. This is the first video I'm uploading and it's so nice to be here because I've been pushing this for quite a while now but it's finally good to come out of my shell and do this so i'm really excited so this is my youtube channel and on this youtube channel i talk about things relating to the youth generally so anything that has to do with the youth i talk about fun stuff i talk about christianity i talk about purpose because see i'm very loud on purpose and i believe that as an individual i'm very loud on growth and i believe that even as i'm growing i can help others to grow with me because true success is not measured by how much you can achieve it's measured by how much you have achieved and how much you have helped others achieve so that's what my youtube channel is all about achieving success for myself and helping others do the same so if you're allowed on things like this if you're interested in also achieving success like me please subscribe to my youtube channel like and share my video thank you today i'm just going to be talking about something really um disturbing something that i've had to face myself in the past couple of weeks and it's really on pressure pressure i think we're in a generation whereby uh everybody seems to be putting out their successes everybody seems to be putting out that they are doing well in this they are doing well in that they're doing well in this and there's quite a number of pressure that is mounted upon the youth in this generation but then I took out time, guys, to read about some of the most successful people in the world. And although they started doing great things, for some of them, they started doing, for instance, the likes of Bill Gates. They started doing things, good things, pretty early, and the ones were like, oh my god, they were 13 years old when they did this, it was this when they did this. But the truth is, none of them actually had a, an, a comprehensive, an all comprehensive list or plan of what they wanted to do with their lives. None of them knew exactly of course they knew they were going to be successful and that's one very important thing i've noticed about successful people they always know that look i don't know when but i know that i'm going to be successful like i know that this is going to happen so when they eventually become successful they are not surprised like oh my god i'm successful i can't believe it it's usually not like that so they usually know but you see the thing is that they don't have a comprehensive list of how when why in what manner they usually don't know those details and so i feel we, we mount unnecessary pressure on ourselves by wanting to know the details of everything about our life now at the age of 25 you want to know uh okay i should be preparing to get married by 26 or 27 i should have my own company like this or i should have worked i should have this so so years of experience now it's good to plan but it's not good to mount unnecessary pressure on yourself which is what i think is very common and it's one of the things that actually leads to a lot of high thoughts, depression, and all of this because you are comparing yourself with. And in fact, have you noticed that it's very easy for you to be 25 and you are comparing yourself with somebody who is probably 35? That's 10 years difference. So I, I host events, I'm a moderator, and at some point I just noticed that I said, comp I said, say, oh, look at this person, this person is doing, and then I forgot that this person has actually been in the business for like seven years, eight years before I started. And so there's a tendency to mount a necessary pressure for yourself. But remember that, especially if you are between the, your early 20s, it's okay to figure things out. It's okay to evolve from the known to the unknown. I checked the things that I wrote about myself that okay I'm going to be doing this in the next five years because I have a diary as so I checked it now although I'm still on track I expect that some of those things have changed some of those things are evolved and it's totally okay to be open to evolving that's one thing many people are not you want to just have have it all figured out I want to do this I want to do that I want to do that that's beautiful but the truth is it's okay to evolve it's okay to give yourself space to change, to adjust, to improve, to get better. <sighs> pressure is really not it. Pressure is, is really not it. And the truth is, it's not going to help us. Now, as I'm talking to you, I'm also talking to myself because I know how you feel. So if you're a youth and you're watching me right now, I know how you feel. And that's why, you know, sometimes I go on LinkedIn and then I see things like, um, I made my first 1 million at the age of 17. I made my first 2 million at the age of 22. I made my this, I made my that. And I'm like, okay. I let that motivate me, but you see, I focus on my focus. You are running your race. You are not running for anybody. And at the end of the day, the person you have to compete with is yourself. 
nobody else and there is no there's no award for coming in late in court because there's really no late there's just such a thing as your time when you come in and so of course as much as i'm very loud on us being intentional about living being intentional about purpose i'm also very loud on not unnecessarily pressuring yourself take your time evolve grow you wanted to be an intellectual property lawyer but now you're finding yourself going to commercial law it's fine it's totally okay to not have it all figured out so just in case you're watching this video and it seems like you know what you stand for you are hard working you're diligent but you just don't seem to have it all wrapped up around your head it's okay i'm at that stage too and it's totally okay i'm learning that it's fine to not have it all figured out but what is not fine is to just sit at one place and be waiting till you have it all figured out keep doing something keep moving keep going while you're waiting to have it all figured out all right i think i'll stop here and then i'll talk about whatever i want to talk about next thing i want to talk about in my next video uh thank you very much please leave a comment let me know if you enjoyed or you learned one thing or the other or you can totally relate with me let me know if you can relate with me in the comment section please don't forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel <laughs> it feels so good to see youtube channel all right so thank you very much everyone my name is Uwanfim. 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 Uwanfim.